probably all know a senior citizen. That's a person old enough to be our grandparents. But are they living alone? Can they still drive themselves? Do they have enough money to buy groceries that last through the month? Are they ill and need someone to check up on them? If so, they can need the services of VISTI. VISTI, which means Volunteers in Service to the Elderly, allows these cherished individuals to live independently in their own homes and to do so safely, comfortably, and in good physical and mental health. Let's check in with Alice O'Reilly, the Executive Director, to see how VISTI got started. Hillary, I am so excited that you're here today and that we're going to talk about the history of VISTI. Because VISTI started 24 short years ago. And I know that probably sounds like a long time to you, but it really, in the life of an organization, is really not very long ago. We had 48 clients, and Catholic Social Services said these people want to stay in their own homes, but they can't do that unless somebody helps them with transportation. So 14 men formed a board of directors, and they then got volunteers, including themselves, to take people to the grocery store and to the doctor so they could stay in their own home. And today, that's still our critical mission. And I think that's so exciting. Why does elderly need our assistance? Here's a few reasons. Many do not have enough money to make it through the month, face loneliness, and do not have family living close by to help them out. VISTI offers many programs to assist their day-to-day -day living. One is called the Commodities Program. After lining up and getting checked in, VISTI clients are allowed to select canned foods, bottled water, and sodas, and any extra items VISTI has on hand. A basket of food is given to each client to take home. Restaurants sometimes donate extra cakes or pies for an added treat. So what did the clients think of the commodities program? Ms. Peraza shares her heart with us. I thank God for VISTA because it's a wonderful program for the elderly. I'm 67 years old and I'm on a very low income, fixed income, but this puts food on my table. And I just thank God for the volunteers and everyone that uh, provides this for us, the elderly. Don't you just love birthdays, especially birthday cake? Visti prepares birthday parties for some of their clients. We also have a birthday program that we do that we deliver um, a birthday cake to every client that's 90 years of age or older. And they are so pleased to have a celebration because when they were your age, it was the Great Depression. And because of that, they never got to have a birthday party. So when you think in terms of the client that's 90 or older, and sometimes they're having their very first birthday party, it's very exciting for them. And our volunteers come and sing happy birthday and they bring a cake and they bring balloons. They bring a Polaroid camera and they go snap, snap with the picture and they're able to give them that picture right then. So it's a, a real special time for them and something that they'll always remember. And, uh, you know, we've got clients that we've been going and celebrating their birthday for several years now, and they really look forward to it. One thing I thoroughly enjoy is sitting down to a hot meal with my family. However, some senior citizens are unable to prepare their own meals. Let's check out Visti's Hot Meal Program. This is our hot meal uh, program. Uh, we serve approximately 160 clients on Tuesdays and Thursdays. It is run totally by volunteers. We have four to five who are servers. We use 20 some drivers each day to deliver the meals. Uh, we deliver Lakeland, Mulberry, Bartow, and to this morning they're having uh, flounder, brown rice, coleslaw, and two rolls. The clients, for the most part, seem to enjoy the meals. 
I often think they prefer just seeing human beings stopping at the door over the food, but they enjoy both. Um, every Tuesday we deliver meals for Visti. We've been doing it for about two months now. We take it, take the meals to the um, Presbyterian apartments up uh, by Lake Morton to about 10 uh, elderly residents. And we get community service hours for it, but it's also uh, very rewarding because they're, they're very appreciative and always happy to see us. So it's a, it's a good, very good thing to do. And uh, I recommend it for anybody who has, has the time and I enjoy it a lot. Out of the hot meal program, the Thanksgiving meal program was born. And it happens here at the Lakeland Center. Decorated bags are filled with the meals and then volunteers deliver them the day before Thanksgiving. What made you want to do this? Well, it's such a pleasure to, to return some of the great blessings that we have had from God and be able to take meals to those who are less fortunate and are confined to home. And we have just always enjoyed making other people happy. How is it going today? It is great today. We are so excited. People are lined up through the generosity to come and deliver a Thanksgiving meal for our 750 clients that they're receiving a meal today. You know, this is really important because the folks that are lined up here today are here to deliver a meal and visit with the client. And that is the most important thing because some of our clients, this will be their only Thanksgiving visitor. In this long line, we spotted one of our own, the McGeehan family. Family, Ms. McGeehan, when did you get started and why? Well, this is our first year. Um, and we basically uh, came up because we wanted to be part of the community and we wanted to help those that are in need. Thank you so much, Hillary, for helping us and your school because it really does make a difference in our Lakeland community. It takes a lot of volunteers to make all of Visti's programs very successful. Many of them work behind the scenes. Here's a gentleman to tell us about his work. I'm a volunteer here at Visti oh, for about eight years now. There are a number of tasks they ask me to do. The one we're working with here now is every Tuesday morning along with hot meals, we prepare what we call a goodie bag. And we take one of these little bags and we put in some juice bags for them and some little fruit cups for them, a couple of pop tarts and maybe some popcorn and we have sometimes we have candy bars and uh, things of that nature. And then we hand out one of these goodie bags every Tuesday along with the hot meal. As you can see, most of the volunteers are older. So you may ask yourself, what can a kid do to help Visti out? At RBW, we did our part by participating in a canned food drive. Our students were asked to bring in at least one can. Cans were brought to the office and picked up by Visti. Our students brought in enough cans to fill 20 boxes. Thumbs up, Wagner Whiz Kids. Fabulous job. Our senior citizens are very special. These are just a few programs VISI offers to fulfill their mission. Our mission is to enable the frail elderly to remain safely and independently in their own home. Through that mission, we're able to serve over 3,000 clients yearly.